Bonjour. Uh, this is our assignment that uh, goes along with our lesson on time. I'm just going to walk you through it. So, um, my question here is à quelle heure? À quelle heure? À quelle heure prends-tu le petit déjeuner? À quelle heure prends-tu le petit déjeuner? What time do you eat breakfast? So, you're going to answer that for me just with a time phrase. À, which here is going to mean at, à 7h30. Par exemple, à 7h30, if you see the little clock here, it looks like it's 7.30. Or maybe um, you might say à 8h, à 8h. So notice that I have a little um, uh, phrase for you here so you know what to do. You're going to stick a number here. If there's any num any minutes after the hour, you'll stick those right there. So, à 7h30, à 7h30, or à 8h, à 8h. À quelle heure fais-tu tes leçons de français? À quelle heure fais-tu tes leçons de français? So, asking you what time you do your French lessons, your French work. Um, obviously, that may, may vary from day to day um, because you have a very flexible schedule with your online classes. But maybe just pick a time, pick what time you started working on French today. So, um, you could say à 11h, heures, à 11h, heures, or à 13h25. At 13 h So notice that I've used the um, 24 hour clock here. So 11, um, that'd be 11 a.m. This one, 13 h 25 would be 1.25. So you can be as precise as you'd like to, or you can round, um, round up. À quelle heure prends-tu le dîner? À quelle heure prends-tu le dîner? So le dîner, here's dinner. So um, you might tell me, à 18 h À 18 h Maybe you eat dinner at 6 p.m. So we, we can also say that à 6 heures du soir, à 6 heures du soir, or à 20 heures, maybe you're more like the French people, à 20 heures, maybe you eat dinner um, later in the evening, around 8, à 8 heures du soir would be the other way you could say that. À quelle heure regardes-tu la télé? À quelle heure regardes-tu la télé? So, um... Just asking you what time you watch TV. So, à 21 heures. Remember, we're using the 24-hour clock, so that would be um, subtract 9 from that. That's, uh, I'm sorry, <laughs> subtract 12, and you'll get 9 p.m. So, à 9 heures du soir. So, um, maybe you don't watch every day or um, anything, but just give me a time that you that you might watch TV. À quelle heure vas-tu au lit? À quelle heure vas-tu au lit? So, what time do you go to bed? Um, par exemple, à 23 heures, à 23 heures, ou à 11 heures du soir, so 11 p.m. À minuit, um, or à 2 heures du matin, maybe you like to stay up really late, so this is how you, is how you would say 2 a.m., so anytime. Jusqu'à quelle heure dors-tu le samedi matin? Jusqu'à quelle heure dors-tu le samedi matin? And um, notice, uh, samedi, we know. Already is Saturday, so I'm asking until what time uh, do you sleep on Saturday mornings, or what time um, do you uh, until what time do you? Yeah. Um, so um, jusqu'à 10h30, jusqu'à 10h30 till 10:30, or jusqu'à midi, jusqu'à midi if you sleep till noon. So your job is to go through each of these questions and tell me in a voice recording what time you do all of these things. So if you want to, um, you can say numéro un, for example, if you go back here to um, this one, numéro un, à 7h30, numéro deux, à 11h, numéro trois, à 18h, numéro quatre, à 21h, numéro cinq, à minuit, Numéro 6, jusqu'à midi. So, that's a little example for you. Please let me know if I can help you if you have any questions. Merci.